what's up guys this is my shoulder workout that I wanted to post for you guys um, the first thing that I always start off with when I do shoulders is shrugs uh, the key is is I don't go heavy and I really try to squeeze it up and kind of control it on the way down that part of the movement you see a lot of guys do a lot of weight but they uh, they're, they're moving their whole body all over they're using a lot of momentum to lift the weight and then they're not gaining anything at the top they're not squeezing and they're not using the negative contraction to slow the weight all the way down um, traps have never been that big of a deal for me I've always been able to make them grow pretty easily but I always make sure that I'm really focusing on the muscle that I'm working and squeezing them uh, as soon as I get burnt out with doing the, the double arms then I'll switch to do some singles just to try to burn out a little bit further I'm only going to show you two sets of each exercise um, as I want to keep these videos a little bit short but I did do four sets of these not just to start up um, but also to just help warm up the joints I do obviously stretch and warm up before I start working out my shoulders but um, this is just another nice way to get into it the next exercise that we have is bent um, it's for your rear delts okay this is the biggest area that a lot of people do not work on and it makes your shoulders look the biggest okay it gives you that nice round cap um, it really finishes the cap off that mid to back half of the cap is what really makes your shoulders look huge so I actually do a tricep for this okay um, I do as many reps as I can where I'm trying to do the reverse um, or the bent over kind of uh, lateral raise but I'm really keeping my elbows out and really just using my elbows as um, holders while my shoulders are hinging back trying to squeeze the blades uh, the scapulas back together um, I then grab some different weights and try to keep my hands in a little bit more and really try to squeeze in the uh, the real real just deep deep part of the back of the shoulder the back of the delt um, and just try to really squeeze that together uh, the last part that I do is mainly for trap and rear delt and that's where I take a bar and I try to keep my elbows out towards my ears and just really pull up and that way I'm working my rear delts but I'm also trying to squeeze a little bit of trap in there just to finish those off and kind of cap everything off with those and again four sets of that guys. The next exercise here um, this is four sets again I do a superset of these and the reason I don't do a whole lot more for uh, my front delts is because I do a lot of um, you do a lot of front delt when you do like chest, especially like incline press and stuff like that. So I try to, um, you know, just do a nice quick superset of this, really kind of get the blood flowing into the muscle. And at this point, I'm already starting to get fatigued, so the weight that I'm using uh, tends to go down quite a bit. Um, but again, these are just dumbbell presses, um, military dumbbell presses, whatever you want to call them. But the goal here, again, guys, is to control on the way down and really squeeze it at the top and really get that stretch at the bottom as well that's the biggest thing that I see guys not do who use a lot of weight is they don't go full range of motion and they don't control the weight throughout the movement um, I then superset that straight into some uh, front lateral raises uh, single arm front lateral raises sometimes I do double arm but again the thing here guys is using a little bit lighter weight really controlling that weight not throwing it up with momentum and then controlling it on the way down too to really burn that front head of your of your uh, shoulder and that's really gonna start to burn as you get into sets three and four of this it really starts to get uh, quite intense but the biggest thing that you need to understand when you're doing this is you know again control the weight see how I'm controlling it on the way down that's what you really want to focus on is never be out of control with the weight this is why you don't really you know I don't work out with a spotter on purpose so I always try to go a little bit lighter and really keep control of the weight and kind of the mind muscle connection constant tension on the muscle and that's at least what makes my muscles grow um, some people are different some people grow a lot more with heavy weight I do not I seem to grow a lot more with more controlled weight and more controlled reps and again you just go right back into your front raises um, just to cap these cap these shoulders off get that front deltoid nice and uh, nice and burnt out and then after this we will move on into our final exercise For the final exercise guys what I do is um, my side lateral raises and I do about seven sets of this okay uh, the reason I do seven sets is my side um, side lateral raises to me are the most important exercise to do for shoulders it really gives you that nice width 
and really gives you that nice cap on your shoulders that really widens your your physique so I, I always again I'm using lightweight I'm not trying to use momentum to rock and how I like to think of it is either you're pouring a water pitcher is a good way or you have somebody who's literally got their hands right above your elbows right on like your arm like your bicep and tricep you're just trying to lift your, lift their hands up okay so what I will do is I'll go a little bit heavier for my first set try to get a nice 12 reps 10 reps of just quality quality reps uh, with a little bit heavier weight to burn them out and then I grab a little bit lighter weight and I try to really focus on my form and really keep it um, keep it under tension the entire time as well as really burning out any last uh, muscle fibers that I haven't <laughs> quite yet used I'm trying to just burn those out and again guys if you're doing uh, if you're doing seven sets of this by the time you're done your side lateral uh, heads are gonna be just just screaming um, and this is a really good workout really quick workout um, it, it'll take you about half hour 45 minutes but it's really effective for the shoulders remember that the shoulders are um, you know they're small so just work them hard and work them quick